Welcome back to News Desk. Now, there was a gun battle between a group of armed men and personnel from the Ghana Police Service at Omena Konya Suhum on the Accra Kumase Highway this morning. Uh, let's get to the phone and speak to the police in the area. And ASP Ebenezer Tete is the Eastern Region Police PRO. He joins us with more on this beat. ASP, tell us more about this shootout and if there's been any arrests so far. Thank you very much. Well, ASP, I don't know if you can hear me, but if you yes, can... Yes, I can hear you. Yeah, we would like to know more about this shootout. What happened this dawn? Um, at about 2.30 a.m., uh, police received an information that there was uh, an attack on a 40 trailer that was carrying assorted groups. Uh, headed for Kumasi. And the highway patrol team quickly proceeded to the chain of crime. That is around the Mina, or Mina near Suhu. When they got to the scene of crime, they saw that the uh, robbers had come in two separate vehicles. That's the uh, GT 3371 13 and AS 13. These were Sprinter and Ford cars respectively. So their intention was to offload the goods from this trailer onto their vehicle. So immediately they saw the police, they opened fire. So the police also quickly also counted them. In the process, one of the robbers, age 17, whose name was uh, given as William Ushu, sustained. And a driver to one of the vehicles, whose name was also given as Manuel Yibua, were both arrested. As we speak, William also is on guard at the Supreme Court of Government of the Body, the suspect, and the driver of the vehicle is also in our custody assisting the investigation. The other robbers managed to run away from the scene of crime. So as we speak, we have, uh, you know, declare them one test and we are on the man hand for the other suspected orders who are able to free from the no crime. How many men are we looking for, sir? Uh, the information indicates that they, they were numbering more than four. So we are looking at uh, four or five other suspects who are now on the run as we speak. Mm. And um Apart from the fact that those who are in the hospital um, have any were any of the policemen wounded or or, or hurt in any way? Uh, none of our men sustained any gunshot wounds. Rather, it was one of the suspects that I've already told you, William Ozu, who sustained gunshot wounds. And this one that at the swing up in the was is receiving treatment. Like the police are on him to ensure that he doesn't also run away from lawful custody. Right. Um, and the, the, the items they were trying to steal, did they make away with these items? They did not succeed. So as we speak, the vehicle that they came uh, to the scene with, those two vehicles that I mentioned, we have impounded both vehicles. And we don't know uh, the source of these, these vehicles, whether they were hired or they belong to them. But as we speak, these are all subject matter of uh, investigation, and we are looking for matter. Mm. Right. Uh, thank you very much, ASP Ebenezer Tete, uh, for your time. He is the public relations officer for the Eastern Region Police Command.